Hi. If you also have the difficulty to load your CSV file on your Neo4j database system and you don't know where the file is replaced in, uh, you need to go to the main page of the, the of the Neo4j, which is this one, it's the new Neo4j, and we have in different place our data pass. It's in the uh, in, in the settings and data it's called data pass. And once we have declared our data pass, and uh, you can choose which hour you want. This is the folder that I've uh, created. It's not finished here. You need to go there on that folder. Once you are in that folder, you need to find the relate data folder and then database MCC, MSS, and then uh, for each database on your, you are working on, you will have the uh, different folders. And when you go in that folder in which you are working on, and in the import, you can uh, you you need to pass your data on your on the import because this is for import. So once you have your CSV data here, you can load your um, that da that data in import on your working uh, working place. And to do so, you need to use the, the classic load CSV with headers because we have headers. We want header to have be there and we are declaring this as row and we have the separator as the semicolon and we are we have the client and product nodes and to create that node we use the merge uh, merge command and uh, we have the uh, the labels in I mean not label the um, attributes inside the client and inside the product and the attributes are our actual column names which are the customer name and product name and at the end we create the relationship between these two nodes which is the purchase I have declared that the uh, customer has purchased the product 